For me, as for many of you, Telegram is one of the most used apps. Therefore, today I would like to share with you some information on how you can upgrade your Telegram. That is, what settings you need to have to make the Messenger much more convenient. This manual will be useful to absolutely everyone. So let's get started! Perhaps I should start with the Saved Messages tab, which can help you use Telegram better. If you don't have it in the chats, you can find Saved Messages in the Messenger settings. This tab allows you to store almost any kind of information – text notes, files, for example, movie or plane tickets, videos, articles or posts to read later. You can use Saved Messages as you like, you can search there, view stuff by category. Moreover, Saved Messages can also become a place for your reminders. After writing the text, long press the Send and you can set a reminder. It's fair to say, though, that over time Saved Messages can pile up lots of information and it becomes almost impossible to find what you need. Although, if you use Sort by Category, it's still possible. In fact, you can have an infinite number of such places like Saved Messages Storages. To do this, you need to create a private channel with a specific purpose. For example, you can store photos in one, videos in another one, useful posts from other channels in the third, and a to-do list in the fourth. By creating channels with separate directions, you can really unload your Telegram and make it more useful. The next thing that will help you put your Telegram in order is Archive, a place where you can send chats, channels or groups that you don't read often and they only clutter up space in the main chats. Here are some ideas for you. Archive all personal conversations that are very old, but you may need them at some point for the information. Or you can archive only channels that you might need, but you still read them super rarely. Turn off notifications on channels beforehand so they will not leave the archive. And from time to time go to this tab and just get the information that you need. You can do the same with groups, often a lot of messages pile up there and so that they don't annoy you, just archive them. Basically, you can really play with this one. Think about what kind of chats you do not need or archive all the chats that you haven't read for a long time. Overall, try out different options and choose the ones that you like. So far we've figured out some basic improvements, and now let's move on to something more important. I'm talking about Telegram chat folders. They're gonna help you set up the messenger the way that you don't miss new messages, you can sort chats by direction, type, I mean, there are also many options there. I'll tell you about the most fascinating ones. Well, first of all, you need to know that Telegram allows you to create up to 10 folders. This is quite enough to put the chats in order. To get started, you just have to create a folder called New. I mean, even Telegram itself recommends creating it. In the settings, go to Chat Folders and there the Messenger provides you recommended options. So in the New folder, you will find all chats with unread messages. It's very convenient to see fresh notifications from time to time and after reading, the the chats will disappear from there. You can even create a few of such folders, for example, new chats without channels or without personal chats or all together and leave only groups. Think about it and play any way you like. Separately, you can create a folder with all your channels or groups or maybe bots, but for example, they will all be placed there, not just those with new posts. Be sure and add a folder where you will have personal chats and if you use bots, you can and you should also create a folder with them so that they are always at hand. Folders can be given any name, you can even mark them with special emoticons, it's only up to you. In addition, Telegram allows you to change their sequence, so list them however you like. Basically, the recommendation is the following. Create folders for each direction and get information from there. Thus, you will simply not gonna need the general chat tab. Another recommendation on how to clean up Telegram is using pinned messages. Many people underestimate this one, but I suggest you try it out. In the All Chats tab, Telegram allows you to pin 5 regular and 5 secret chats. Try to start with the usual ones and stick to the most important ones. Of course, you can go further, because Telegram allows you to pin up to 100 chats in folders and archives. After creating folders, be sure to pin the most important chats there. For example, in the Work folder, you could pin the chat with your assistant or your boss. 
and in the folder with people, you can pin the chats with your best friends, for instance. This way, again, you sort the chats and the most important ones will always be in sight. In fact, these are to organize Telegram and put it in order. Don't be lazy. Make folders, pin chats, create separate channels for different needs, and trust me, you will get even more pleasure from using the Messenger. Share in the comments below some of your options, how you arrange Telegram. I'm super interested to know how you're making the most of the Messenger. And don't forget to like the video if you found it helpful, and of course, subscribe if you haven't done it yet. It's the Telebloke channel. Subscribe to find out more.